Dear friends, as Christians, we are called to stand for the truth and to stand upon the truth. We're not to be ashamed of the gospel. We're not to be ashamed of our Lord and Savior. We're not to be ashamed of what we believe because we believe the truth and we need to stand up for that truth. Ephesians 4.15 says to speak the truth in love. It is loving to tell someone the truth. It is hate when you lie to them and when you agree that their sin is okay because they're going to stand before God one day and it ain't going to be okay. We need to stand for the truth. We need to call sin what it is. And we need to point them to Christ. We don't need to pat each other on the back as we live in immorality and as we live against the ways of the Lord. We need to rend our hearts. We need to return to the Lord. We must draw near to the Lord. But it's going to start with us standing for the truth, calling sin what it is, and pointing those who are lost to Christ. We must be bold, not ashamed. We must stand for the truth, despite what others may think, because we answer to God and we seek His approval, not the approval of man. So let's live this day standing firm upon the Word of God and living out His truth within our life and sharing the gospel and speaking the truth, and calling sin for what it is. Because that is true love. True love is a sacrificial act. It is not an emotion. It is not a feeling. It is not just words and speech. But true love is demonstrated to us by Christ upon the cross. So today, let's walk in His truth. Let's not be ashamed that we are children of God. As we stand upon his word, as we proclaim the truth of his word, as we proclaim the only hope that this world has, and that is Jesus Christ, that we must repent of our sin and put our faith in him to be saved. And so, if there's someone who needs to hear truth today, Ephesians 4.15, may each of us share the truth in love. God bless you.